So we've, we've got a very fragmented, you know, marketing in the new age, new era, as we would put it, is split between three areas, the CIO, CTO, the CMO, and the sales organization. Uh, so th that fragmentation, you know, used to be the, the only thing you saw, you know, you might see public relations going up through the general council or something, and that was the split. It's much more complex now and much more fragmented. Well, who's doing that in a good, I mean, you, we're seeing major marketers start to combine some of these things. The tech companies understand this most. Okay. Do you see any sort of big brand marketers? Do any of you have any examples of just rejiggering that CMO role to encompass some I of can't these? think of one that is, that is consolidate, maybe it's not the right thing to do, has consolidated those three things into one. I know a lot of CMOs who are frustrated they don't have control over the sales function because of the, you know, Amazon, 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 which at the moment is probably about 12 billion of ad revenues. Google last, last year was at 125, and Facebook was around 52, so it gives you orders of magnitude. My view is that Amazon will get to 100. But remember that 60% of all that revenue is long tail, because the, where Amazon are focused is the long tail. It's the small business and medium-sized business enterprises that they're, they're going after. But they're focused on that sales function, and I, I know CMOs are very frustrated about it. I know CMOs who are frustrated that they don't have control or influence or a voice on the CIO, CTO piece of it, but I can't think of anybody who's brought them together as one, and I think that's where we're going to see a little bit of development because I think the more sophisticated ones will start to think about it that way. Do you, do you see it as a communications issue, or do you see it as a misalignment so it's issue? An, it's an organization issue. I mean, you know... The, as we define the CMO, as we think of the CMO as a, as a marketing organization, we see the interrelationship between those three areas. I'm not sure that inside organizations, the CEOs or the CMOs or the CIOs or the CTOs or whatever are prepared to make, make the change. But they are becoming much more correlated uh, and much more integrated. Parti particularly, I think, um, the sales organization and the marketing organization. That has to come together because Amazon, which is such a force, you know, when Amazon launches, you know, the wake up call is, uh, I'm trying to remember the name of the shoe that uh, Amazon copied, private label. Oh, the yeah. Right. That's one. Then Lady Gaga, I mean, we were doing a road show in America and then amidst the road show, Lady Gaga, they, they launched the Lady Gaga Cosmetics. That's a an amazing wake-up call to any of the branded cosmetics companies. 